Hello, Carl here with Sustainability Theory News. We're over at Kickstarter.com, and they have a campaign for a self-watering grow bucket called the Grow Bucket. And we'll go to the diagram in a second. It still has a long way to go. It looks like they just started the campaign today. Here is a diagram of the Grow Bucket. It is a sub-irrigated self-watering container. <clears throat> now, sub-irrigation has many benefits. One, you don't lose water to evaporation. If you're growing this on a porch where there's not a ton of direct sunlight, evaporation might not be a key concern. Or if you're in a spot like Michigan where I'm at, water isn't very scarce. But in a lot of areas, this can be a great water saver. Also, it limits the amount of pests and disease on the surface of the soil because the surface of the soil stays dry. So fungus gnats stay down. You can even uh, put maybe diatomaceous earth or another material on the surface that could help kill any pests that come crawling around the plant. So there's a benefit as well. Also, it self-waters. You just fill up the uh, hole right here in the PVC, fills up the reservoir, looks like it holds up to one gallon, and then the roots penetrate through the top of the surface and slowly wick up the moisture into the soil. I imagine it's not a perfectly watertight seal and some of the moisture wicks up from the side here and over here. Now, what makes this unique, there are a lot of self-watering buckets out there, is this can just be inserted right into any five-gallon bucket. And that can take a bit of effort converting a five-gallon bucket into a self-watering container. And it seems like they're pretty well-priced, about a little less than 10 bucks a piece when you go through the system. It also has this little stick on a cork, so when it gets lower, you can tell, hey, looks like I'm low on water. You can even automate these things, and one of the rewards on this Kickstarter campaign includes an irrigation kit. So it can automatically fill up the reservoir for you, so it can be even more automated. You can grow a lot of different things in these systems, and you can use soil or uh, perlite or other hydroponic type mediums as well. A lot of information here, and of course I will link to this Kickstarter page in the description. If you'd like to see more news headlines like this, subscribe to my channel. Have a great day.